know another group down in, uh, in um, South of Atlanta called the Bank. So it's actually, uh, they meet on Shabbat. You, know, so. you do too? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, so we believe this place is all about Yeshua, about Jesus. Uh, it's about his crucifixion, it's about his death, burial, and resurrection. The most important part, as you know, is the resurrection. Because Christ died for our sins according to the scriptures. He was buried. He was raised the third day according to the scriptures. It was according to the plan of God. And it's possible that it may have happened at this place. We can't say for certain that it did. Uh, we don't make that claim. But what we try to share with you is what actually the Bible says about the location of where Jesus was crucified and and the tomb and also the garden in relation to the crucifixion and the tomb because they are all linked together actually and those of you who have been here before will know that we're situated outside of the old city wall now if you turn around you can actually see the high wall that's over there that's actually the northern wall of the old city you've been to Jerusalem for a few days have you? so you've probably walked inside the old city over behind the building there is the Damascus Gate. You may have walked through that. Not yet. So there's also a gate over here behind the bus station. You can see the buses here. And behind there is another gate called Herod's Gate. Further along is where the temple was. And you know that's where the Temple Mount is today. Uh, where the Dome of the Rock and the Mosque of Omar and El Aqsa Host and so on is now.